so it's raining really hard. It just it just started uh, like a couple minutes ago, but um, yeah, uh, it was like really windy earlier, and then it just started like pouring out of nowhere. But um, earlier today we did the teacher recruitment day, and it was it went really well. We were really pleasantly surprised that how well it went and we went and saw about seven or eight people today but yeah um it was it was really good we went to a lot of texas schools and um yeah it was it went really well and then i had to run go change get my get some stuff that those clipboards that i made and take them to the college of education picnic and then I um, had to run over there and I was almost late to class. So, because uh, it was like really late, I walked in like a minute before it started. So then I had turned in my speech outline and now I'm just hanging out with Scott while he practices. So I'm going to go do that again. <laughs> so excited I love Friday because usually I don't have anything to do on Friday I don't have any classes or anything that I have to go to I don't have to go to practicum on Friday but today we actually um, I had to go because yesterday I didn't get to go to practicum because of the teacher recruitment day it was a uh, excuse absence but still I had to make up those hours so me and um, my friend Laura went to practicum today and I just got back. I think I'm about to go eat lunch with Scott. I don't know where we're going yet but it's gonna be a relaxing day. It's gonna be nice to have uh, not have any um, anything to do, any responsibilities really. I still need to get stuff done but at the same time it's nothing that's due like right now that I have to get done today. So that's good. I'm still I'm gonna start studying for the PLT this weekend, probably today, I'm going to start doing it. The PLT is part of my second part of the practice that I have to um, pass before I can student teach. So I need to, I have to pass this one because the scores have to be in June 1st. So I'm taking it May 1st. So I mean, you can't take it after 30 days. So um, until after 30 days. So I have to pass it this time. So I'm really, really, really nervous. So I need to start studying. I can't believe this this week, I mean this month has just like flown by because like a couple of weeks ago, or feels like a couple of days ago, I was just like, oh, well, I've got all month of um, April to study, but now it's like the end of April. It's like April 19th or something. It's like April 19th. So I can't believe. <laughs> so I have like 10 days to study. So have to get on that so I can make a good score, a passing score. So, prayers for that would be appreciated. Um, so yeah, that's all I'm going to do today. I'm just going to relax, have, um, not fret over anything, not run around or anything, just kind of like take it easy. Maybe I'll clean a little bit. I don't know. Who knows? Hopefully I'll get to hang out with Scott a little more. But, um, yeah, I know he woke up late today, I think, so he probably has to practice and stuff because he's getting ready for a senior recital, um, in May. So, yeah, um, that's about it. That's all we're going to do. So, we'll probably talk to y'all later. Bye. So, this music is what we listen to on a daily basis, pretty much, in here. It's like... What is this called? Classical? I mean, no, what station? What's the station called? Oh. <laughs> You're listening to NPR, that's National Public Radio, brought to you by the good folks up in Washington. And uh, on ULM, it's University of Louisiana Monroe.
uh, they have a they have a channel that's specifically for this that they basically they get the signal and they resend it out. I guess I'm not sure how they do it exactly, but they send that out, and so now we're able to listen to it. And they actually have a lot of really good things on here. Like they'll play a lot of classical and jazz and stuff like that. And they will. Um, they also have like a lot of segments that are like really interesting. Like the other day, they had a segment where a guy got on there and talked about um, just different random instruments that you can just make yourself and play, like the uh, cigar. Um, electric guitar and that was really cool and I think uh, a couple of my other friends actually listen to this a lot too it's just like it's just like instrumental music like it's only instruments no words <laughs> <laughs> I just think it's funny that we listen to that funny well I mean I don't know yeah okay it's, it it's funny 